The, the monoliths that we collect are roughly 8 inches by 40, 43, and 4 inches deep. So we got to have a pretty good uh, place to, to, to look at it. The first thing we do is we, we, we cut down the face to, to get it back a little bit to clean it straight up, up and down so it's nice and clean. And then we, we have to push on the, a frame, a metal frame, and enough to encase the profile that we want to represent the soil that we're collecting. And after that, then we press a piece of plyboard on top of that to hold that soil profile in place. And then we have to carry carefully, uh, it's cut, cut behind it, and make sure that we have a fair break behind on both sides of the profile. Um, a, one of the strategies that's been developed is using straps to go around behind the whole the whole profile in more than one place and that way it gives it gives some stability from the inside but ultimately then we cut all the way back behind it on both sides and then in this scenario we'll make a cut above at the top through the roots and all the way through and then we will quickly and carefully lay the soil on its back and then from there we'll pick it down in an office. Well here uh, we've brought the sample in from the field. Um, we uh, shaved the top down over here where we could put it on a mounting board. We uh, uh, applied glue to the mounting board um, and put the mounting board on top of the sample. And after it's, uh, we strap it down to that, we flip it and so it's uh, adhered, uh, glued to the mounting board. Once we have the sample on the mounting board, we pick it down to both reduce the mass and uh, reveal the, the natural structure of the soil. And this involves just uh, trying to remove clods, small clods. You don't want to take off too much at once because you may, uh, it may damage the, the sample itself. So what these shows um, is just the structure, the, the variability within a soil. And without actually going to the field and digging a pit, it will show the public what a soil profile looks like and the differences between the soil profiles for the different soils across the state.